Weather 12 forecast. Well, it was an absolutely gorgeous day today with highs in the upper 50s, and we're going to continue that trend right on into Easter Sunday. Let's take a look outside right now at our live cam in Lincoln here, where the only changes that I'm in anticipating going for forward towards the start of your day on Sunday will be decrease in the winds that we've been seeing, but an increase in clouds, which could lead way to some more partly sunny conditions as we start our morning tomorrow on Sunday. A river update now. We do still have some river flood warnings in place, although these levels that we're seeing now in minor flood stage for these rivers is continuing to decrease. So we're expecting these to be dropped within the next day or so. But with more rain returning next week, could see some issues again. But obviously, a few days away, we'll be keeping you guys updated on that. Temperatures right now still comfortable out there in the 50s. We're at 57 in Providence. Down towards the coast, a little bit chillier in the low 50s. We're at 50 right now. Newport Glendale right now at 53. And with that, we've been seeing some gusty conditions this afternoon. These will continue this evening before winds start to decrease overnight tonight. Just in head just ahead of the holiday tomorrow on Sunday. We're still seeing some wind gusts around 20 miles an hour farther inland down towards the coast, closer to 30 miles an hour. So we're looking at breezy conditions continuing this evening. As I mentioned overnight, not looking too bad, although there is a slight change chance for a passing shower, especially down towards the coast, but we'll be dry again just in time for the holiday. Sunny, nice day expected for Easter Sunday, but we are tracking some more unsettled weather next week with the potential for even some snow as well towards the end of the work week on Thursday. So let's take a look at the temperature trend here. Warm on Sunday and Monday, a little bit milder, closer to average Monday, but then chillier towards the midweek. And with the system that we're tracking, could see some temperatures dipping below freezing, bring a mix or some snow to the area. We'll have more details on that coming up in the next few days. Your wind gust forecast here. A lot calmer wind wise to start the day, but we could see some breezier conditions towards the afternoon again before winds start to die back down as we head towards Sunday night into Monday. Satellite and radar clear still right now, but we are going to start to see some clouds creeping into the area as we have this low pressure system to our uh, west and south here. This will move to our south pass us, but we could see some passing showers from it during the overnight hours. So let's take a look here. As you can see, around 3.34 in the morning, Potential for a couple passing showers, especially down towards the coast, but will already be a lot drier for the start of your Sunday. Chilly start in the low 40s will warm up nicely, though, by the afternoon. Plenty of sunshine throughout and with those calmer winds, making for a very nice Easter Sunday if you have any outdoor plans, especially. So your Sunday morning here again, chilly start, but will warm up nicely by noontime already in the 50s. Clouds that we're seeing in the morning will also start to decrease, and we're looking mild and dry for the rest of your afternoon. Let's take a look. Right now, your seven day forecast here, where again, could see a passing shower overnight tonight, but anything that does move through will be very brief and then looking a lot better for the start to your Sunday. But if you are heading out on the earlier side, definitely want to wear a jacket as the start of the day will be a little bit chillier than the afternoon. I know a lot of people have church tomorrow and just fun things outside. So that's welcome news, even though a coat is involved or a jacket, yes. a light jacket, which is, which is typical this time of year, especially because Easter's a little bit earlier, but overall super nice day tomorrow. All right, thanks so much. Now in sports, LaSalle opening up their lacrosse season with a dramatic game. Derwin